What's going on everybody? We are back in my very messy basement, as you can see. Wanted to give you an update on the car. So, talked to the dealership yesterday. Uh, warranty company's not doing anything. So I gotta pay for all of it out of my pocket, which it is what it is at this point. Uh, repairs, everything that needs to get done is gonna be $3,400 out the door, which is a lot of money. Don't have all that, so we'll see what happens. Um, but that being said, the parts that I need are on back order, so that's fun. Yeah, she said it's going to be probably close to three weeks before parts actually get shipped to the dealership. So I've already been without my Jeep for three and a half weeks now, so it'll be another at least three and a half before it's fixed. Because I mean, it's not going to they're not gonna be able to fix it the same day the parts come in. Um, so we're going to be on seven, almost eight weeks without my Jeep, which really sucks. That's like two months. Um, but that being said, I'm not paying for the loaner. So I double checked on that. I asked her yesterday. I have to go in and re-sign the contract for it, but I will not have to pay for the loaner. So I am very pleased about that. I uh, just have to pay for the gas that I put into it, So, which kind of sucks because it takes 93, but gas mileage is a little bit better than my SRT. So just want to give you guys a really quick update. I know this is going to be a short video, short, sweet to the point, but that's where we're at right now. $3,400 out of pocket. It's actually like 33.9, like 3,397 or something like that. Um, we'll say 3,400. It's 3,400 out of pocket. Parts are on back order for three weeks. Probably another week to get it fixed. So we'll be out seven, eight weeks total before I can get it back. Free loaner, so I'm cool with that. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. I think that's where we're at right now. So it's been a very interesting winter, to say the least. Uh, did get my tax return though, which is good. So I have some of that that I'll be putting towards the Jeep. I did have to pay other bills, which I can understand like people would get that. Um, but yeah, so I had to pay some other bills and I bought a gimbal, which I'm currently using. So if I turn the camera around, it's super smooth, or it should be anyways. Um, but that's something that I'm gonna be using to actually hopefully make some money with uh, this summer if I do some car videos and stuff. But uh, yeah, so that's where we are. That's where we're at. Uh, paid some so I have a little bit of money, but I don't know, I have to borrow some, I guess, to get the rest of it fixed. Side note, don't buy an expensive car if you can't pay for the expensive repairs. Just gonna throw that one out there. Um, but yeah, hope you guys are having an awesome weekend. Uh, enjoy the rest of your weekend. This should be Saturday when this video goes up. But enjoy the rest of your weekend and I'll, I don't know if I'm gonna have many update videos uh, unless parts come in sooner, something like that. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. So peace out. Thank you.